think this interaction between different companies and different sectors is hugely important and, and we've benefited from that. And um, I think we must continue making sure that we learn from one another because it's always good to have a, a different perspective. At the center, we've got our ERP model solution that is an enabler for other solutions with Kira to affect the risk execution throughout the risk management process. And that was maybe the most important factor that we wanted to achieve, that we can link us to all our different solutions that we have in the system. So that means that we will link a specific existing risk to a regulatory and a legal compliance solution. We will link a specific risk to an internal audit. So internal audit will look at what we have in our system currently, and they will physically base the internal audits on specific risk that is existing in the system. The same with our combined assurance, making sure that we can take an existing risk, link it to our combined assurance model, and making sure that whatever happens in each one of these solutions then also provides feedback back to the risk owner and back to the control owner to every level so that there's a closing of the loop and so that you can make sure that there's specific actions that improves our risk solution, that improves our risk profile, our current controls and making sure that all of these are interlinked and stays interlinked throughout the process. In our combined assurance model, it's a combined and focused effort of management of internal as well as external assurance providers with the aim to assure the effectiveness and the optimization of the current and future risk control structure. So that's important to us so that we can have that oversight from our group functions. So we've got our four different operations and then we've got specific group functions that provides oversight and making sure that our control structures are effective, they're well designed and implemented, and that they're actually doing what we've intended them to do, mitigating the risk, reducing our risk profile, and ensuring that our controls are effective in managing and mitigating the risk. And then at the end, everything is customized and controlled and managed in a QRA system with a user-friendly customizable web platform. We've got interactive dashboard views in the system and we also have a couple of reports where it all ends up to make sure that we can look at the system, that not the system is not only an input system for the risk owners, but that the risk owners on mine level can also derive some value and they can have a quick view over all of these solutions of what their situation is and what the status of that is. Is there any overview actions or are there any specific actions in the system that they need to attend to?